Of all the stories Al Jazeera reported in 2015, few resonated quite like this one. More than a million people, men, women and children, trekked across deserts, risked their lives crossing the Mediterranean Sea, hoping for a new life in Europe. The refugee and migrant crisis started quietly years ago and is far from over, but in 2015 is when the world took notice. We have the latest on the crisis in a moment. But first, a look back at some of the moments of the coverage Al Jazeera calls desperate journeys. People die and there's red in Syria. Fighter jets launched airstrikes on the divided city of Aleppo. In Yemen, devastation has become the norm. No, another choice. It's a war. migrants here are not happy they are returning to Libya. Here comes another boat. No matter what triggers this mass movement of people, the war in Syria or Germany's implied promise to take all of them in or the false promises of the people smugglers, no matter what started it, no matter what perpetuates it, there is no easy way of stopping it. They have given up everything to make this journey and they say there will be no going back. Your family got across and you are stuck here? Walking to Germany. It's a very, very long way. These people have been here for more than two hours in a standoff. We don't know, they stop us here. There's a somber realization of the people and the places they've left behind. We have to take care of them. They are having a honeymoon. Come on, Stasha! They're telling me that they had so much fun and they danced. This is the first time they smiled since they got here. You just stop the world. We don't uh, want to go to Europe. Just stop the world. Just that. <laughs> 